Katie Hart with HDPhysiques.com reporting for NPC News Online. We're here in downtown St. Louis for the first form St. Louis Pro. I'm here with IFBB Pro, second place winner, Brooke Walker. Brooke, oh my goodness. Where have you been for the last two years? I've been in hiding. No, I'm just kidding. So literally, it was like almost two years to the day that I stepped off stage here in St. Louis and I came back two years later and I finished off the second place finish that I'm very, very happy with. Um, so there was no particular reason why I decided to take two years off. It just seemed what was best for me at the time. Um, I had some improvements that I wanted to make on my physique and my shape. So I also wanted to like enjoy some vacation time, some food, some alcohol with friends and family. So that's what I kind of did. Um, you know, but sometimes I think people mistake the idea of like taking time off means you're not training. And that's not the case. I was training hard and trying to make improvements and, and take the judges feedbacks on particular muscle groups and my shape and implement that in my training. And, you know, I came back two years later with in my opinion, my best package to date, and I'm very, very happy with it. Um, and in all honesty, I'm just so happy to be back on stage. So obviously you've made some drastic improvements. Can you tell a little bit about who you're working with as far as coaching? Yeah, so um, a lot of my feedback was always to bring in my waistline. I was like, always my waist, always my waist, um, and then always my back as well. So kind of what I did is I just, literally alternate like days or well every single week whenever I train back I'll alternate between deadlifts and rack pulls and then I did a lot of waist training. I actually stopped training like core in particular um, and I also worked on like widening out my lats to create the illusion that I had this little tiny waistline. Um, but aside from that, um, I've worked with Jose Raymond. He's been just a blessing. He's an amazing guy. Um, and I always kind of go back on the fact that I started in 2012 as a bikini competitor. And uh, here I am now, an IFBB Women's Physique Pro. So I kind of have just made the transition, and I've loved it. Women's Physique is my division. I love every single aspect of it from the posing to the like sportsmanship that we have between competitors you know we're all like a tight-knit little group of girls and i really enjoy every single aspect so obviously we have some points now yeah. going towards the olympia so what's the next step um you know what i don't know quite yet i'm gonna obviously be back on stage this year um i really had to like get my mind right to to get back on stage so i'm here and i feel really good um i'm gonna be honest whenever i was coming on stage i had a mixture of emotions you know coming up into this weekend because you know, I kind of was like, do I normally feel this way? Because it's been two years since I've competed, you know? So I was a little nervous, a little excited, had some anxiety about it, you know? But once I got back on stage and kind of got those jitters out, I was really, really excited to be there. Um, I'm obviously going to step on stage at some point again, um, maybe soon, I don't know. But we're going to see, see kind of what I need to do and what changes I can make and then jump on up there. She's leaving us in suspense here. Yeah. Right. <laughs> Brooke Torrance Walkerton, yeah. thank you so much for your time this afternoon. Congratulations thank again. You. We couldn't be thank more you. proud. This is Katie Hart signing off with NBC News Online.